it's like any business really it's controlled risk you know or controlled I think that's the right word of risk if you want to call it that but as long as you you know it's aviation and electrical law is brought into the is brought together to do this work and as long as you don't try and cut corners with aviation or with electrical law then you're, you're very safe my name is Lawrence Perry from Haverfield Aviation. Um, we're here to install bird mar markers on the upper shield wire on the on about five or six, maybe seven spans across this open water. And it, they're just they're called bird diverters, bird distractors. They just uh, let the birds see the wire. Effectively, is what it is, and they hang down and move um, in the, with the wind. Even if there isn't much or any wind, these things move because those lines tend to vibrate and anything at all will get them vibrated. So there's a little bit of movement in there. There, there are these fluorescent colors to make them more visible. Then they also have this uh, phosphorescent color that will glow after dark for a while. And the advantage there is in the summertime, our days are so dang long, there isn't all that much dark. So that, you know, we're going to get some coverage into the dark. They'll, they'll see something up there. We're at, we're at one. You know, I, I could do things that could make his job hard and he could do things that make my job hard. So we, we want to try to be together. We want to work together as much as we can. Um, you go out there and start getting that wire moving all over the place. You know, because the top wire that we're going to be working on, it, it, you know, you, when you, especially when you get out mid-span, you know, you can move it a lot. So if you move it a lot, then he has to chase it because he's working his butt off if you, you know, and then if, if he can't keep me close enough to the wire, then it's going to work, works my butt off, you know. It's basically, you know, it's a power line, power line. I mean, it doesn't matter really how you get up there, you know, helicopter or bucket truck. Oh, this suit is made of, um, it's 75% Nomex, 25% stainless steel fibers in it. What it does is it bonds you to that platform right there. Um, anytime you're around any, any, any energized circuit, it's a company policy that we wear this. We, we call them hot suits, but wear it, you wear it on the platform. On, on some of the bigger lines, we work on three quarter million volts, which is 765,000 volts, and that that's quite crispy. And then that, <laughs> in that case, I'll, I'll actually wear a suit as well. And sometimes you'll feel, you can feel the electricity, on, depending on the condition, you can feel it buzzing around your neck. And sometimes it creeps up in the back of your helmet. And my hand is in the open doorway. And sometimes I'll feel it on my hand or my wrist if I don't, if I'm not wearing the stainless steel gloves. So. Uh, it, especially those high voltages. So, so how port, important is that partnership between the pilot and you? Very, very important. And we watch them closely when we go eat at night. <laughs> we make sure they don't have maybe one or two beers and that's it. <laughs>